Hey everybody, Mental Fox here. Welcome back to Fallout 76. Well, this is where the game decided to start me off. It's weird, uh, because you know, at the end of the last episode, we were over here by, uh, this butterfly here. Uh, and it was nighttime, but, uh, now it's daytime and I'm back over here by the, uh, Battlefield Cemetery. Which is kind of weird. Uh, and then when I, right when I started the game, I got this, uh, daily quest again, where I'm supposed to, uh, bury this body, remember that? Um, and I actually brought the body here last time, uh, but I didn't have a shovel to bury him, so he went unburied. Uh, you could also see that there's something called an ounce of profession up there. Uh, that is the main quest. Uh, I'm not really sure why that's on, I might have turned that on. Uh, at the end of the last episode. Actually, I think I did because I was curious to see where it was on the map. And uh, if you remember, that is way down here. So we are here and that is there. So I guess I could just kind of start working my way in that direction. Um, you know, maybe I could just walk along the road here and see where it takes me. Maybe. Uh, maybe I could visit this over here and see what this is all about. Um, there's like a dam or something here. But the problem with that is that it takes me back here into Morgantown. I really don't want to go back to Morgantown. Um, because there was all these events that kept going on down here and I've already explored that area. So I, I, I just really don't want to go back. But other than that, I'm not really sure what I, what I want or need to do. Uh, this is here, but it's way up on a, on a ridge uh, that I can't get to, and I'm not even sure how I get to. It looks like I'd have to go this way and maybe go through this pass right here, so that's uh, pretty crazy looking. Uh, so yeah, I think I'm just gonna follow this road and see where it takes us. We'll just go for a little bit of a walk here and uh, explore Fallout the way you explore Fallout by walking around. Uh, huh. Ooh, okay. For some reason there is a Vertibot up there. You go right ahead and vert away, Vertibot. Just be as verty as you'd like. And we'll just go for a walk and hope that we don't run into too much trouble. Uh, up at the very north part of the map, Knife Edge, remember when we saw this? Uh, it looks scary to me. I don't know what that is. I'm sure that you guys will let me know in the comments what that is. Oh, we've discovered a region called Savage Divide. Now that's interesting. And I think you know why that's interesting. That is interesting because I do believe that I have two treasure maps that are in the Savage Divide in my inventory right here. So let's kind of duck behind here and pull out our treasure maps and uh, take a look at those. Those are in our items under notes, maybe? No. Um, hollow? Uh, no. Where... Where are these treasure maps? Did I accidentally put these in my, uh... I think I accidentally put these... Well, maybe, maybe not even accidentally. I think I put these in my stash. I think that's where they are. They're up at my camp in my stash. And I think I did that because I just... I, I, I wasn't in the, you know, the Savage Divide or whatever yet. I'm gonna drop these uh, spoiled things. And look how much spoiled meat I've got. I mean, what is up with all the spoiled meat and spoiled vegetables? I don't even know what meat and vegetables I'd picked up that's gone bad. Yeah, so I, I, I guess I dropped off these treasure maps. I don't know, I don't know why I did, because they don't weigh anything. So... Oh, can I use this? There. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm super curious what is going on. Um, but I want to look at those. Now, what I, one thing I could do is I could fast travel to here. Um, but then I'd be up there again. How would I get back here, you know? Um, oh. Dan, I just don't even get a moment to myself ever. <laughs> I had to walk around the corner there so that more rats saw me. Oh. Oh, there's a bunch of them are rabbit. Oh, he had a lot of stuff on him. Hey, where do you think you're going? Oh, yeah. So I'm going to pick up this meat. It'll probably go bad. Do I need teeth? I don't know. Alright, let's... Uh, it doesn't look like it's going to cost me anything to go up here. 
caps wise. So let's just go ahead and fast travel back up to my camp and I'll look at my stash and see if I could find those treasure maps. Just, um, I don't know. I don't, I don't think they weighed anything. So I'm not sure why. I would have put them away. It must have been an accident. But anyway, let's go look at our stash here. Uh, let's see. Transfer. Uh, notes. Hmm, okay. There we go. Savage Divide treasure maps. Let's go ahead and grab these. We'll take these things. And, um... Let's see here. We will go ahead and, uh, craft this meat that we just picked up so it doesn't go bad. These drinks, some blackberry juice, it's good stuff, man. Well, that's all I can make. And as far as food goes, uh, whoops, uh, rad roach. So I don't, I don't know, when you cook something, does it go bad? I don't know. I have to keep an eye on that. I don't think it goes bad, but uh, we'll have to see. Okay, well, now I'm here, now I have the maps, now I want to go back to where I was. Well, can I fast travel to here? I can, it'll cost me four caps. Uh, I'm going to guess that I can't fast travel, oops, I guess I guess that I can't fast travel to a place I haven't been yet. Now, I can put a marker, but I can't fast travel there. So, I could fast travel here, and that'll put me in the Savage Divide. Uh, so, let's just go ahead and spend four caps. I mean, it's no, I know it's not very far, but... Uh, let's just kind of speed things up a little bit here. We've already walked that length of road several times, so we don't need to walk it again. We'll just fast travel, spend some caps. Okay, let us go this way again and go to this place called Savage Divide. Now, I don't know if it's going to tell me again that I'm entering it. Because uh, I don't think it says anything about Savage Divide here on the map, you know, so... I don't know how I know, like if I forget, how will I ever know that this is the Savage Divide if it's not written on the map? That's what I want to know. And I have a feeling this thing's not going to tell me again that I'm entering the Savage Divide. And which direction exactly is the so-called Savage Divide? I don't know. So yeah, see, it's not, uh, it's not telling me. Again, so I, I, I just have to remember that this is the Savage Divide. Let's go ahead and look at our maps now that I've got them. And let's see if I can remember which buttons to press for crying out loud. Uh, items, uh, notes, Savage Divide treasure map number three. This one looks like this. This one, man, I wish I could move my cursor around so I could point to stuff. You can see there's power lines there, and there's like something you can climb. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, that's... Oh, go away. Jeez. Man, did I just cut him in half? Ugh. Oh, jumping right up in front of me. Anyway, that, uh, that map points to something near power lines, and I don't see any power lines right here, and I don't even know if power lines are on this map, and it doesn't look like they are. Um, so, yeah. Gosh. So, yeah, this one... I, I mean, I also can't help but notice off to the right there, there's like a camp up top. And that makes me think about where we just were. Um, where I got attacked by the uh, red scorpions. But that they didn't call that the Savage Divide, and I didn't see any Ooh, I wonder if that's a dam there. See the N, the circled N? I wonder if that's a dam. I bet you that's a dam. Yeah. Okay, and then we have number 10, which I haven't looked at as much. This one... There's an X there. We're looking east. There's not really any landmarks here that I can point out. There's a car there. There's a hole in the ground, maybe. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm looking at here. Uh, I will say that... Oh, come on. Uh, I mean, there's a car here, but 
I don't think this is what I'm looking for. Hmm. I'll take that stuff. I don't need the wine. Bunch of uh, beer bottles. He's even holding a beer bottle. Uh, cooler here with some snack cakes in it. Huh. So... I don't know, man. What is this black stuff here? I don't know. Yeah, this this map here isn't making a whole... It doesn't mean a whole lot to me. I mean, is this a road? I hate the bend in the piece of paper there. It makes it really hard to see what I'm looking at. Um, but is that like a road with a hole in it? And... Yeah, this, this map doesn't mean anything to me. So, I don't know. Uh, but what I am going to do is, let's, um, I guess let's walk down here to this. Well, let's go over here first. We'll check this place out. I'm not real sure. I'm actually not sure which way I want to go. Go this way to get back on the road. And then... Yeah, the road goes up there. Alright, well, I guess this is the road I want to follow. Hop over that. Huh, look at that up there. There's like something walled off. It's kind of interesting looking. Let's go take a look at it. Is there anything in here useful? Doesn't look like it, does it? No. no let's go. This is probably a mistake. Oh, that was a dumb way to go. Let's go around the other side. Oh, I'm thirsty. Need something to drink. Items. Purified water or... I can drink some of this other stuff that I picked up, such as blackberry juice. It's pretty good stuff. Helps in the food department as well. Let's go see what this is. Hmm. I guess it's just a road closed thing. Alright. Get back on the road. I'm gonna go ahead and, um remove this uh, quest since we're not really heading there right now just kind of free up the screen a little bit why not and we'll just go ahead and walk here I mean am I still in the savage divide I don't know there's some power lines but they're not the kind of power lines I'm looking for I'm looking for those big ones those big power pylon things some Stuff buried over here on the side of the road. It's not even radioactive, man. And then... What is this, like a little... Um, Pull-off here for a scenic view, looks like. Looks like that's what's going on here. I'm just using my... Uh, vats from time to time. Let's see if there's anything interesting hiding out there that I don't see. Well, it's um, nice and quiet. There's something up there. Whatever that is isn't on my map unless it's part of that. Could be. Oh, here we go. There's one of those big power things. Does it just end there? Is that the last one? And uh, that's kind of interesting up there. Looks like there's a path that way. I wonder if that's that. Let's go and walk up here just for the heck of it. Something's making a weird sound. Oh, this looks interesting. Let's go check this out. I like to check things out. See if Vats picks anything up. Nope. Yeah, so there's those power lines. Oh, 
We got Radroach here. Hello, are you the welcoming committee? Give me your meat. Oh. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. Was that your friend? Oh, look at this one. Glowing Radroach. Disease glowing Radroach at that. I hate how it takes two hits to kill these things. Nuclear waste. I don't need that. I don't think I do anyway. Motorcycle lying here. Little hiking trail. Hmm. Colonel Kelly Monuments. Okay. A walking cane. Some right arm bones. I don't need any right arm bones. Not at the moment, anyway. Beer and squirrel bits. Body here. What's left of one? Let's listen. Hi, I'm Dick Shale, here to welcome you to the Colonel Kelly Monument. As you take in the view and history, consider using a Braxo brand cleaning products. <laughs> I would. This monument, deep in the wooded heart of... Wait, where? Of the heart of the Appalachian countryside, overlooking majestic Grafton Lake. Grafton Lake? I hate these last minute changes. Kelly raised the first West Virginia and became its colonel in May of 1861. Later in June at the Battle of Philippi, uh, Philippi he was severely wounded. I like to think that the colonel would have used a Braxo cleaning products. You can learn more about the Battle of Philippi at the Philippi Battlefield Cemetery. I can't wait to see you there. Okay. Well, oh, lunch here yet. <laughs> it's weird that the words are different than what he says. Alright, so here's a monument. Colonel Benjamin Franklin Kelly, 1807-1891. Union Command at the Battle of Philippi. Philippi, I don't know how he said it. Okay, that's looking interesting down there. Is that the... Uh, yeah, I guess that's... Wow, that's pretty far away, though. So I'm not sure what I'm looking at. And uh, this monument here, I mean... I don't know... What's important about it. But uh, here it is. Important game-wise, I mean. That's interesting looking there on the side of that. Is that some kind of, like, ant hill or something? Alright, well, we took a little detour here. The monument... Not very exciting, but uh, something to see. Let's keep on walking here. The shell of a bus or something. I don't need any of that crap. Let's keep moving. Let's go back down to the road here. We'll turn right and we'll keep following the road, see where it takes us. Yeah, there's something up there. That might be the top of that thing we see on the map. Yeah, it probably is. Whoa, whatever it is, it's big. Yeah, I'm kind of curious to see what that is. Something's making a sound. It almost sounds like an engine running. Whoa, whoa, what's this thing? Flatwoods Monster? Whoa, look at that thing. Whoa, I do not want that level 30 thing to see me. Holy crap, Flatwoods Monster, what the hell is that? It's weird he's making this noise. There he goes. Look at that. What in the world? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm not ready to take on a level 30 something or other. That's for sure. He would, uh... He would eat me up. Alright, let's avoid him. Interesting. 
So I wonder if like he's one of a kind or if there's going to be a bunch of those. Oh man, there's a house over there. Okay, he's still way up there. Let's see if I can get in this thing. I just I just got to see what's in it, you know. This might be a mistake. Well, we've got a battered clipboard. You know how much I love battered clipboards. I don't need any of this crap. Flask and a table knife. No, there's nothing good in here. That is so bizarre. <laughs> Whatever the heck that thing is, the noise it makes. It's weird. Alright, let's get moving. Get away from that thing. So, um... Maybe at some point we'll come back to it. We will come back to Site Bravo, but that's actually up on this ridge here, so... There's really no indicator... You know, that we just saw something interesting there. I wish I could, like, leave a marker in notes, you know, so I could leave a note for myself on the map. What am I hearing? I heard something. So here is, like, a transformer station. Down there is a Scorched Believer. Believe it or not. It's a Scorched Believer. Nice. Snuck attack him. And he dead. Oh, he's twitching. Yeah. I love sniper rifles, man. They're so great. They're so great. Oh, gosh, there's a lot of these dudes down here. Got another one. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. That's my binoculars. Switch. Oh, gosh. Of course, I need to reload. Oh, you're not dead? Oh, you're not dead, so you're still not dead. What the? Okay. <laughs> oh, man, you got nothing on you. All right, fine. I didn't want your crap anyway. Poseidon Power Substation PX03. Or 03, I should say. So, we found a power... Substation. Hmm. These guys ain't got nothing on them. The heck, man. I feel ripped off. Hmm. Power box activate. Hmm. I don't know if I want to do that or not. Let's go look around in here first. Oh, this looks interesting. A dirty pillow. Gotta store that dirty pillow, it's important. You gotta put that in a lockbox. Don't want anybody getting your dirty pillows. Plan for newsstand. I might hear breathing. But maybe not. Might be the music. Kind of breathy music. Up here's these things. Man, they go all up, up the hill up there. I mean, we look at the map again. Is it this one? It's like a little hut. Off in the distance, you see something. I'm thinking this is near the. Uh, the, the dam, I think. Right underneath the end, there's like two towers there, but I'm thinking maybe that's a dam that's broken. Uh, but I could be wrong about that. So, do I want to turn the power on here? I don't know if I do or not. I really don't. A hairbrush. Oh, okay, this guy's got some interesting stuff. I'll take that. Let's see if we can get in here. Boy, that door looks giant. Oh, I'm healing. <laughs> well. One cigarette in that suitcase. Alright, nothing interesting in there. 
Well, let's see what happens if we turn on the power. I don't know. Map updated. Poseidon Energy Plant WV06. This power box will provide more power if something. Well, no idea what that said. But uh, something was just updated. Put on my map. And I hear something walking in this direction. And whatever it was must have walked on by. Anyway, something was put on my map. Um, let's see if I see what's new on my map that wasn't on it before. Not... Maybe here? Nope, that's not it. That's a relay tower. Okay, this we've been out here before. We've been to Sutton. Um, hmm. Just looking for something new. Maybe even something that looks like this. I think it was another substation. But not seeing anything new on the map. Huh. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> I've already been there, too. Well, whatever it put on the map, I'm not seeing it. If you guys see it, point it out. But, uh, yeah. I'm not seeing anything new power-related here on the map. That's too bad. And then, as far as, like, whatever... You know... Whatever that message said, I don't know. It's gone now. It's getting dark out here. So, if I keep walking... This way, I'll hit this road. Maybe we can go over here and see what this is. Just for fun. Alright, why did that come up? Yeah, what is what is this? A mine? The colors are changing. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Whoa. Looks like somebody's been fighting some super mutants here. Is there a player around here? Well, there's this guy, Rage Fire. Maybe um, he came through here and took out these uh, super mutants for us. Could be. Well, whatever this is, I'm going to walk towards it. Grafton Steel. Now, I think we heard about this place when we visited the Woods Estate. <laughs> Grabbed in steel with an A. <laughs> Remember, um, that Woods guy... I don't know if he was the CEO or what, but... He started replacing people with automation and they were not happy about it. Oh my. Yeah. Protest sign, ain't a commie. I ain't a commie. But I get where they're coming from. Oh, uh-oh. Skirmisher around here somewhere. So these are the must have been parts of the robots that had uh, replaced them. I want to work. Baton. Yeah, so. Skirmish took place here. That was terrible. Look at this. I can't even hit the guy. Oh, I got him again. Oh, I didn't kill him, though. Uh, I think there might be dudes elsewhere, too. <laughs> I woke him up. Alright, let's hide behind this. Oh, gosh, really? Okay, there's a dude up there. Let's see if I can pick him off from up here. Go. How are they hitting me? Where did the dude go? There we go. I hit him. I really like to finish him off. Okay, we got him. Reload. Man, they are shooting right over my head. 
That, that's a dead guy, right? Yeah. That was a good shot. Nice headshot there. Alright, let's clean this place out so we can go in and look around. Nice. Oh, grenade! Oh gosh, that exploded quick. Oh gosh. Nice move on their part. I'll give them credit. That was a good good move. Let's heal up real quick. Oh, damn it! Gee whiz, man. There is no getting away from those. The second they show up, they also explode. Tough, man. Give them credit. They're the toughest ones I've encountered so far. A oh, level six, dude. All right, took care of him. Any more dudes? Well, it says danger, so there must be. Oh, there's a dude right there. Huh? Did I get him? Oh, a couple of dudes there. Another guy here. What's he got on his head? It looks like he's got a Lego head. Oh, what? Oh, I leveled up. Cool. Level 14. He's got some interesting stuff on him. Well, let's see if we've cleared this place out. We could explore it now. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, yeah, he had some good stuff on him. So they've got um, gas canisters on their head. Oh, jeez. That'll work. Here him come tromping around the corner there. Oh, there could be a lot more of these here. And I'm over encumbered. Should come as no surprise to anyone. That was probably the longest I've gone in the game since the very starting uh, without being over encumbered. Super Mutant are in here somewhere. Cop car with a health bar. Yeah, I want to explore this place, man. Oh, I'm a thirsty. Let's take a drink. Uh, what do I got? What can I drink? Let's just scroll through here real slow. Um, well, I thought I had more choices. I guess I could just go straight to purified water. I'm also getting hungry, so I might as well eat something while I'm here. Let's uh, switch to one of their weapons, just for fun. We'll switch to, uh... Short automatic pipe rifle. Doesn't do much damage though, so I don't really know if I want to use this or not. So I'm pretty sure there's at least one more super mutant around here. Iron ore. Alright, I don't know why I want this, but I'm taking it. Stuff I can store in my stash. Pipe wrench there. Don't need that. Yep. Definitely hear somebody else walking around. And he might even be right over here. Let's go see if we can find this guy. He's in this building. Responders emergency signal. Signal found. Is he above me? Oh, there's one over there. Oh, a super mutant brute. Oh, I did no damage to him. None. No damage again. What the hell? That's a bunch of crap. Pretty sure I hit him. So who in the world is tromp? 
tromping around out here. Are my headphones on right? Yeah, they're on right, because it sounds like he's coming from the right. Oh, he went up there. What the heck is this guy? Definitely hear somebody stomping around. Oh, this place is big. Sheesh. This place is huge. Alright, well. Ooh, there's a battle going on over there. I like to look at my map. Yep, I bet you it's this guy. He's over there. Fighting someone or something. And there's something... Right there. Little fire. There's a dude running around up there. He's level 22, dude. Oh, he's got a camp up here. So he's fighting something. But he had a little automatic weapon, it sounded like. That's kind of cool that you could see from that far away, huh? <laughs> yeah, that's pretty neat. Hmm. Alright. Um... Let's see here. So I could favor it, favorite it, and then does that put it in my little wheel here? Here. Yeah, it does. Okay. So when you favorite something, it just puts it in the next available slot. It looks like, which is kind of weird. Whoa! Look at all this. Bunch of super mutants. Dead out here. And they've already been looted, so... Again, I wonder if it was that... Rage dude that came through here. And then, uh, if, if it was him... How come there's still super mutants here? Did they... You know, respawn... When I showed up? Well, look at this guy. Whoa, he's scary looking. Yikes. Got a tire iron through his head. That's a scary looking dude. Workroom. Okay, here's a, uh... Tinker's workbench. Could scrap my junk. Still didn't free up enough space though. I don't need all these rifles. This leather left arm isn't really that great. I'll get rid of it. And honestly, I don't even need this, do I? I mean, it does 13 damage. It has a really quick fire rate though. I don't know. I have a lot of ammo for it. Let's let's use it for a bit. Plan Tinker's Workbench. What? What? I don't already have a plan for a Tinker's Workbench? I'm pretty sure I do. That's good stuff. <laughs> Another dirty pillow. What the heck? Uh, okay, so this is where I was a moment ago. Oh, where'd he go? Boy, he turned the corner quick, didn't he? I wanted to try to shoot him again. I guess these guys are walking around over top of me. Alright, let's keep looking. Keep exploring. Oh, here's some first aid. That's good to get. Absolutely. Here is a weapons workbench. I wonder if I need to uh, repair any of my weapons. Let's take a look. Uh, my machete. Wish I could upgrade my machete. Oh, I could put a serrated blade on it. Ooh, there we go. Weighs a little bit more, but it'll do a little bit more damage. Let's do that. Cool. Uh, this guy that I'm currently using. This thing. I could repair it. And as far as modifying it goes. It's got a scope on it. It's Paint. I don't care about paint. And, uh, yeah. Snow nose barrel compared to standard long barrel. The standard long barrel gives it way more range, right? So, what's the drawback to using the, the standard long barrel, barrel? To me, it looks like it's just way better. So, I, I don't see any drawback to doing this at all. I don't know. Standard grip. Nothing I could do there. 
Okay, well, whatever. I'll take the fuse. Okay, apparently... What? Oh, there's another fuse in there. Alright, I thought I missed the fuse. Huh. Quest started. Claim... Oh, it's a claim workshop. Who cares? I don't care to claim a workshop. We claimed that one at Hemlock Holes before, and... I don't know. Didn't really do anything for me. Oh, hi. How's it going? Am I doing anything? So he's, I believe, using the same weapon I'm using. So he has to stop and reload from time to time. Like I do. Oh man, did I knock his head off? I think I shot his head clean off. Oh, look at this. Somebody left a plan for a water filter here. Well, I'll take that because I don't think I have that plan. Molded plastic. Alright, I'm just going to take that because I haven't seen it before. Man, this place is so big. I am... I'm going to get lost. Who is talking and where? Yeah, this place is so big. There's a terminal down here I'm interested in looking at. Oh, a holotape repair plan. Let's listen to this repair plan. so bad if y'all just shut the damn thing down for a few weeks and cleaned out the blast. At this point, whatever it is, at this point it's fused with every damn part from the furnace to the smelter in the mills. Look, Mason, I don't need to hear it. Can you keep it running or not? That ain't gonna be easy. Whatever's going on chemically, it's pretty toxic and corrosive at that. You're gonna have to keep making near constant repairs. I can mark the areas, but... It's not gonna stop the ash. It doesn't give a damn about the ash. The workers brought it on themselves, now they get to live with it. Besides, the bots don't care. All the more reason to continue the workforce chain. So, that's it then. Just keep replacing bots and machinery and let the plant destroy the valley and break up the strikers? If you got a problem with that, we can cancel payment. It's just... Get me in the van, okay? And get me out of here before anyone sees me. Yeah. Pleasure doing business with you. We'll recommend you to our friends. Don't. Don't ever contact me again after this. And erase my name off that hollow tape. I went over the needed repairs. That's enough. Fine. So, what I got out of that was the factory needs to be repaired. And it sounds like he doesn't want to do it. He's going to let it blow up and kill everybody. I think that's what he said. Um, so yeah, we've got this claim workshop at Grafton Steel Yard where we're supposed to clear enemies. So they're all marked. I mean, I'm going to clear them anyway just because I want to explore the place. But uh, I don't really care to claim this place. Whoa! <laughs> I have discovered the Grafton Steel Yard. I can't believe how big this place is. I don't need any of that. Yeah, loose screws, I don't know. Are they worth anything? Are they useful? Are they scrap? Something's beeping. Whoa, look at those two dudes standing over there. I didn't even hit him. Oh, for crying out loud. Do I have to get closer to him? Oh, for Nobody sees them, and I know just the place to dump them. 
That's what they get for failing to endorse me. Okay, so I'm supposed to pick up some barrels for this thing? Um, pass the buck. Grafton's mayor needs me to take the toxic barrels from the lake and dump them elsewhere or get them out of sight somehow. These barrels... Oh, whoops. Super moot. Somebody's talking to me, but I don't see him. So... I mean, look... <laughs> Give me a break. So we could turn that quest off. This event. No, it's not even an event. Is it a side quest? Yeah. Turn that off. So now the barrels that he's talking about... Are around here. What's making this noise? Is it this thing? Oh, it's the workshop that's making a noise. Okay. Well, I mean, I can... Sure, I'll activate it. Oh, it can't be activated with enemies nearby. Alright. Oil seep. Okay, whatever. So what are these guys... Look. Look at this. What? Alright, well... Okay. Well, there you go. Oh, 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 I'm actually hurting him, look! Gosh. Okay, I killed him, look, he's dead. Look, he's picking up his stuff. Let's kill this one too. Whoa! Okay. Weird. Uh-huh. Duct tape. I like duct tape. So, that's a little messed up. What's this thing? Oh, this is one of those uh, extractors. Whoa. I don't want to get stuck in here. Man. I can't get over how big this place is. Whoa, weird. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at this. What is down there? Mylark Hunters, level 24 dudes. So he wants some stuff taken from the lake, and I'm not sure I want to go down there with those Mylark Hunters down there. What a, oh, whoa. Did I just zoom in again? No, I didn't. Where am I on the map now? Yeah, okay. Well, I mean, we're getting close to the dam. This guy's just hanging out up here. But here's some barrels I'm supposed to pick up. And this tower... This thing that's on the map... I can't really see it from here, so I don't know what it is. I just want to go around. Oh, look at this. And I didn't hit him. I should shoot this guy because he's going to shoot me. Although both of them are going to shoot me. Oh, he's throwing grenades. Damn it. The gr There's no warning. You see the... Oh, gee whiz. Okay, then. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Huh. Wow, they're really good at throwing grenades, man. Okay, well, I guess I'll respawn. And, uh... I'll respawn at Grafton Steel, because that's kind of where I was. That's kind of a bummer, man. Uh, okay, so it put me here. I kind of like to go back, get my bag of goodies. So let's see if I can go back to where I was. They're out here somewhere. Maybe I went out this way. Yeah. I think it's one of the dudes that shot me. Killed me through the grenade. He didn't shoot me, but he threw a grenade at me. Take care of him. Get my revenge on these jerks. Oh, I got him. That's cool. <laughs> oh, hey. Gosh, I love the one-hit kills. Love them. Oh, I can claim this if I wanted to. 
Spend 31 caps to claim this workshop. Other players may initiate PvP with you. I'm not going to spend 31 caps on that. Jeez. Uh, let's see. My death bag is over here somewhere. Yeah, here it is. Look at all this stuff. It's a lot of stuff, man. Transfer, take all. Yeah, I'm sure. Took it all. Whoops. So, seeing those level 24 mire lurks down there, I'm not so sure I want to go down there and try to pick up these barrels. Not so sure I want to do that at all. Um, really, I just kind of want to explore this place. It's a cool sign they've got. It's pretty neat. Oh, hey. Oh, gosh, there's... Oh, look, there's a hound over there. Oh, man, I didn't hit him. Oh, give me a break. Uh, okay, I guess I got him. Got the hound. Look at this doofus. What? Uh oh, something stung me in the back. Where is he going? You need to come down here? I don't know. Maybe he's a smart one. Maybe he's actually uh, leaving my line of fire. Look how big this dude is. Oh, I hear some tromping. <laughs> Jobs now or else. Uh huh. That was fun. <laughs> Sneak attack on that guy. Oh, hi. Oh, gosh. There's a bunch of them. There's a bunch of them in there. Oh, gosh. Are they come. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, ouchies. What the? No, 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 not grenades. Not grenades. Not grenades. Getting kind of hectic up in here. Where are they? Oh, he's going to throw a grenade. Man, right in the head. Oh, it looked like he was shooting at something else for a moment there, but maybe not. What the? Okay, this is a level 5 dude. Whoa. Oh, I got him. <laughs> oh, grenade. Oh, that's hardly doing any damage to him. Oh, gosh. I'm stuck in something. Chosen. Oh, man. oh, I didn't get him. <laughs> Where'd that guy come from? He's backing up. Yeah. Better heal up. Damn. I'm going to take your stuff. That was a little crazy. Little bit crazy. Well, so... You know, I did all this work to clear these guys out, but it's really all for naught, because this is where I have to end this episode. And, well, you know, when we start the next episode, not only am I going to be in a different location, but all these guys are going to be back. So, it's a little disappointing. I just really wish that the place would stay cleared out, you know? Uh, but it won't, so when we come back next time, I guess I'll just keep exploring this place. Somebody's still walking around in here. And uh, just seeing what there is to see here. Um, so yeah, this episode we just did some exploring, which is fun. I hope you had fun. If you did, why don't you let me know. Maybe leave me a like or a comment. Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> hope to see you again in the next episode.